Hey guys, you're watching RBHD, and today you've probably noticed that I've shaved my head. I look like a damn Kiwi. So today we're playing Thief Simulator, a game where you can pretty much train yourself to be a thief and then take them skills to the real world. I wonder if I can steal myself a set of hair. I don't know what show he's watching, but he's definitely being distracted by something. He's probably broken in someone's house and just started watching Jeremy Kyle. Okay, so B is to sneak, so he's doing great so far. Why can't I get over this three foot fence? Picked up a crowbar, but it's no use if I can't get over this fence. We're not even past the training, I don't even know where we're going. Okay, so we figured out how to equip this crowbar, and instead of jumping over this three foot fence, Instead, we're going to just break through the through the fence panel. What? Personally, I thought that would be the easiest option. Okay, we got to sneak now. She's there. Don't look at me. Mind your own business. I'm just following a waypoint. Wait, what? You suck. You have been caught. <laughs> what? <laughs> I was following the way to go. <laughs> I guess I've got to deal with it. Okay, we're just going to sneak past you. Stop calling me, Vinny. Some dope left a flashlight on the ground. Take it, but don't let nobody see the light and call the cops. To be honest, Vinny, I'm more concerned about you calling me while I'm trying to be a thief. I don't think a flashlight is my main priority at the moment. Okay, so we're in our first house. Let's see what valuables they have. Oh, we've got $15. Thank you very much. We'll take that. I like how we can steal a teapot. <laughs> Let's take that as well. Oh, another $15. I love the way the money's just being placed in random places, like not even in a purse. Let's take this pot, this will be worth about $2. I'll take your dodgy toaster, and I'll take your saucepan, so I can make some eggs in the morning. A Rubik's Cube? Why can't we take that? That's like the only item in the house that I'd actually be happy to take. <laughs> Let's get out of here. All right, we've got, to, we've got to leave here now. Climb out of this window. Where are we going? Don't mind me, sir. I'm just, um going the absolute wrong way. Oh God, there's a car there. Where, where are we meant to be going to? Let's go. I've just I've just got in the car and I just can't drive. Okay, so the stuff we actually stole was a teapot, a pot, an old toaster, a saucepan. I mean, to be fair, we could make ourselves a decent breakfast in the morning. Okay, we've stored our stuff in the car and we're going to rob our next house. Okay, this house looks quite big, so I'm expecting to at least walk out here with anything but a saucepan. Can we play... Knock door one. Oh, heard by tenant, run. <laughs> we just play knock door one. It's not even a thief game anymore. Hello, sir. I've just knocked on your door. Don't mind me. This game is just going to be me knocking on people's doors and running away. I've been heard by the tenant. Climb. Climb. Why can't I climb? Okay, run again. Run. For some reason, I can't climb this because I need climbing gloves. Just climb the damn thing. Ah, we can use our crowbar. Our trusty crowbar to break down certain panels of the fences. Oh, gotta love gaming people. What is a robbery without taking a saucepan? Let's take that. Let's take a tea box so we can have tea as well. Oh, and let's treat ourselves to some wine. I mean, we're not robbing the place at this point. We're just going shopping. Okay, so there's apparently no back door to this building. So we're just gonna leave here. <laughs> Thanks for your teapot. <laughs> Don't mind me, I'm just um, a regular person passing by. Don't look at me suspiciously like that. I'm just a regular person walking past. <laughs> Blocking path. <laughs> I'm just stopping it from getting to where she wants to be. Start the engine. Oh, I didn't realize we were meant to drive away. I thought we were just storing everything in this tiny box. <laughs> drive out of the location. I've robbed two houses though. <laughs> Was I meant to do that? <laughs> My thief rating is B. That's probably because I just stole pots and pans and some tea. <laughs> Get some sleep at your place. Okay, there we go. We're gonna be waking up at 11 p.m. tomorrow night. That's a decent sleep. What's Vinny's obsession with me? Check the computer. There's a few things I need to tell you. I can't check the computer. I need hacking tools to check my own computer because <laughs> I forgot my password. Okay, so to steal a big item, you need to put it in your car's trunk and drive home. And to sell it at a pawn shop, you need to put it then next to the shop. I mean, the items I've, I've stolen were just pots and pans, so I don't think we're going to get much for them. Okay, so at the pawn shop, we're going to be selling our wine and um, a few pots and pans. And I'm sure he's going to be amazed. <laughs> okay, so our wine goes for $10 and the radio goes for 25 but I can't sell my pots and pans. If someone rang me this much in real life, I would block their number. Oh, 
I've just run over a sign. It's cost me $1. <laughs> oh my God. I'm so bad at this game. Nobody's home all the time, so we really don't need to worry. Wait, what do you mean I'm blocking traffic? Why am I blocking traffic? I'm not blocking traffic. There is no traffic. Leave me alone. I'm trying to steal stuff. Hold on. What? Why did I just hear a police officer? Okay. I'm just going to take this front door key. This money. The police are on the map. <laughs> I don't know what I've done. <laughs> I'm not stealing anything. I live here. Okay. I'm getting me regular pots and pans. Can we steal some ketchup? No, we can't. Okay. We've got a TV. Let's, um, let's get out of here before the cops realise we don't actually live in this place. We're going to have to take the back way. I can't believe I paid for this game. <laughs> oh, that's the traffic. Don't mind me, sir. I, um, I'm just going to work. There you go. You can get past. Wait, why am I paying the repair cost? You ran into me. Someone bumps into me and I have to pay for it. And we need to put this in the boot. Okay. Open. There we go. Now, how do we point, point it? I'm struggling to put my TV in the boot. There we go. Okay, I don't know where we're supposed to be going, but it's still telling me to go to the house. <laughs> I don't know what I've missed. So we're just going to check this out to see if I've missed anything. Oh, because I didn't check one set of drawers. Jesus. It's probably just going to be a saucepan. What? Oh my god, there's nothing in there. <laughs> that was all for nothing. I'm pretty sure I'm just meant to drive home, but the issue I have is I have no idea where home is. Okay, I'm just going to go this way and um, act like I know where I'm going. God, the driving's awful. <laughs> I don't know where my home is. That's home. Okay, that's fine. <laughs> we finally got home. Okay, guys, that's it for today's video. I hope you have enjoyed. If you have, hit that like button, hit that subscribe button and leave a comment for any future videos you'd like to see. Uh, in the meantime, I will see you in the next video.